I love Mr. Quiet. I love the character. I love the color of him, the design of him. He's just very, very simple, but very effectively illustrated. And I love the story. It speaks to me very much. We learn that Mr. Quiet is a very quiet individual. He likes to spend time by himself. But unfortunately for Mr. Quiet, he lives in Loudland. That's beautifully illustrated. I absolutely love that. And everybody in Loudland is very loud. And because Mr. Quiet can't be heard, he doesn't get anything. He doesn't get the things he's going for, his cornflakes, his sausages. So he ends up all alone and very tiny and not liking his life at all. Then one day, he receives a letter in the post. And it's actually an invitation. He's so cute. He kind of looks... He looks adorable. Um, he reminds me of somebody, and I can't work out who it is, another Mr. Man character. Um, but one day he receives a letter from Mr. Happy, and he goes there. And Mr. Happy says, okay, well, you come and stay in Happy Land with me, and we'll get you a job. And Mr. Small, Mr. Quiet says, Mr. Small, that's who he looks like, different colour. Mr. Quiet says, but I can't do jobs, I'm too quiet, nobody can hear me. But Mr. Happy knows the perfect place for Mr. Quiet. And that perfect place is the library. I love it. Uh, for somebody like me who grew up being a very quiet child, um, you know, very shy and very nervous around other people, I could really relate to Mr. Quiet. And more than one occasion, I've been told to speak up when I was younger. So I think there's certainly an element of relatability here that young children will be able to relate to. And it shows that even if you're quiet, there's a job for you too. So I have to say, it's a lovely story. It's a beautiful tale. And he's a really likable character as well. I really thoroughly enjoy this one. I think this is number 29. Yeah, number 29. My cat's meowing there. She clearly uh, agrees that this is a fantastic book. Really enjoyed it. Mr. Quiet is definitely one that I could have related to as a child, even as an adult, and one that I think is an absolute delight.